Hey YouTube, Dan Ottawa here, coming at you with another Great League Remix team. In this one, uh, the Steelix is the rank one on PV Poke for the Great League Remix. So I wanted to test it out. And at the time, I also wanted to test out Shadow Lapras because I was still debating bringing it to regionals. So we were dealt weak to fighting in the back, so I needed something to deal with fighters. And I used Shadow Hypno just because a lot of the sort of dark fighters were banned. So if you're going to have a fighter, it's likely something that's weak to Psychic. So I was like, okay, let's just use Shadow Hypno. So let's get into the battles because there's two uh, things that happened in this that I want to discuss. And the first is Shadow Hypno because you're going to see here I had a great lead. And then comes in Blastoise. I'm like, you know what? I'm already ahead on energy. These confusions should ship. I got a Thunder Punch. This will do super effective. Let's just stand here. And Shadow Hypno, for those of you who don't know the history, Shadow Hypno was the top five i think it was probably around like number five ranked on pv poke in like seasons one through three because it at the time had the one of the most bulk it could have coverage everything from thunder punch to all the punches a shadow ball for a lot of things that you can one shot and then you come here and i'm just like i just do a super effective shadow thunder punch at a blastoise and it didn't even do anything it didn't take it out and then i have the double shield Super effective confusions, can't even get to the move. So Shadow Hypno is was one of the most disappointing Pokemon that I used in this, and I and it shows why it's now gone away. Just because one, there's darks everywhere, there's ghosts everywhere. It doesn't have the bulk it used to because all these XLs are here have way more bulk. It doesn't hit hard enough anymore. So it was good early in seasons like one through three, but it does not work anymore. So that was kind of disappointing. The Steelix is an interesting one because I've used it a few times. For the most, why why it's ranked one in this is because it runs the fast move of Dragon Tail, and the Psychic Fangs lowers the defense. The Dragon Tail is going to hit basically neutral on everything except for Steel and Fairies, and for the most part, the Steel, the main Steel and Fairies are going to be gone. And then you have Psychic Fangs, which lowers your opponent's defense, and just the Dragon Tail Psychic Fangs combo, like I, I, like you're just gonna see here, you can just out muscle, right? I lowered their attack with the with their lowered their defense with Psychic Fangs. That's not not take me out. Get to another one, take it out. And it's just it's a pretty quick move to get to. A Psychic Fang doesn't really hurt. It's not a, it's not a move that does a lot of damage, but it just lowers your defense, and the Dragon Tail does all of the the damage. And you're going to see it's sort of the weakness here. Same sort of thing. Like the waterfalls are adding up. I'm getting to the Thunder Punch. So super effective Shadow Thunder Punch. Like doesn't even, it barely takes them over half. So it was just so disappointing. I tried to catch a move thinking they don't really have any other move besides water. Because I do not know the moves. They have Psychic. Okay, cool. It's an ABB team. So you need to try and draw out a fighter anyways. So I'm fine with trying to draw out a fighter. Trying to chip it here. Shadow Lapras is pretty good. Um, and I'm getting shield because we see MP there. They want to throw the Psychic. That's fine because now I'm going to have get some more energy advantage here. So the team... Again, I, I ended up switching. So there's two things. One, Pelipper's. Noctowl's banned in Remix, but Pelipper's is still there. So everyone is using Pelipper. So <laughs> that was a nice shot there. And then Steelix was decent. Again, I would run this team. I actually ended up running this team third with. I did like a one shadow hit one Chan, at the front just for fun, and I won that matchup. But I'm like, okay, that's that's enough battles. I, I think the next two matchups. I think I win this one, and the next two you're gonna see is I lost. Like it's not an amazing team, and I think the the, the downfall is shadow hypno. So I think Lapras in itself is worth using. I think Steelix is worth using, because you can just Dragon Tail Psychic Fang most things, and then Earthquake was just a nice second like nuke you can also run crunch like crunch is the other move so i just ran it because i ran the nuke and you want i wanted coverage but you can run crunch for sure uh but yeah hypno just so disappointing like look at that they're at the lunge the lunge is basically gonna one shot me because i'm psychic so i have to shield and then reset thinking like i'll just bank that move come in here they come with a gel sense this is where crunch would have been nice because I could have just crunched them super effective. So I probably, if I did this again, maybe run crunch. I'm going to actually just look up what the main move PV poke says to run in the remix here. 
Crunch. They do say crunch. Steelix Shadows number one. Steelix non Shadows number two. Right. So it's a it's a beast of a Pokemon. It says to run Crunch. Crunch makes way more sense. I wasn't thinking at the time. I would definitely run Crunch. Pidgeot is in this too. Right. So you have uh, Flyer and Pidgeot. You have Flyer in. Is Noctowl in the remix? They're, they maybe Noctowl is allowed in the remix. Uh, actually, it is because I used it day one. I used Noct I used the triple bird. I used Noctowl, Pelipper, and Gliscor. So Noctowl is in here. Uh, Pelipper's in here. So lots of flyers that you can use, that you can resist with the steel in this. So nice Pokemon to use. That's why it's ranked number one. And Lapras is probably not high on here, but it has its play. Yeah, 80 and 81. So I think Shadow. the problem with Lapras is... The Ice Shard is nice and the Surf is decent. The second move is where the problem is because you either run it with Ice Beam, which if you run into like a water Pokemon, you have no move to throw at them. So that's why you don't run it with Ice Beam. The second move is Skull Bash and Skull Bash just takes so long to get there. It's a non-stab normal type move. So that's the only problem with Labras is that sort of secondary move is, is kind of weak for shield pressure um, and it takes a while to get to. But otherwise, I would definitely use the other two. I would not use Hypno, and that is the team. So I'm, having, I'm just having fun. Um, this is going up Tuesday. When is my pseudo widow going up? Because I've got one more team. I got a couple more. I've got like two more Great League Remix teams before Thursday. So I think pseudo widows may be going up Thursday. They caught an earthquake on a Pelipper, so nice catch there. Uh, I have. I think I, oh, I think I used a double ice team because I've seen too many flyers. So I think I used a Frostlass, Frostlass, a sand slash, I think is one of the teams, right? Two ice types in the back, just not with both ice moves. Shadow Claw because it's a community day move. So nice. It was fun. It was, that, I think that team worked really well. And then Pseudo Widow is again, one of those nice coverage teams because it's a rock type Pokemon. So you resist the wing attacks, you have the rock slide for it, but it also has a counter fast move. So you can deal with like Steelix and all these things that are weak to counter. So that was a nice sneaky Pokemon to use. I saw, I saw, I think I just saw Home Slice the other day, put up one with it, but he used double rock. He used rock slide and meteor, whatever the new rock move is. I used earthquake just to have some coverage in case you do need to throw an earthquake. So out comes an Octowl. And let's see here. Let's see how much this Thunder Punch does. Shadow Thunder Punch. It's going to take more than two. Okay, maybe with the confusion that won't take more than two, but I can't believe it. I can't believe how how bad this Pokemon is now. Anyways, that is it. Is this the last battle? This is the last battle. So um, that is the team. Those are the teams coming. And then I'm going to do a couple more just great league. I'm not doing Fighting Cup. I refuse to do Fighting Cup. Uh, I hate limited metas. I hate limited metas with one typing. I hate limited metas with one typing and Pokemon Game Band. No way am I doing Remix. I will, or the, the Fighting Cup. I will stay with Open Great League next week. So check out for those videos next week. That is it. Thanks for watching. Hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe button. Um, please comment for the YouTube algorithm and I will appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.